Coming up on Beef Boys. Number 15. Meat <laughs> rotting balls. <laughs> Meat and rotting balls. <laughs> if, if you're that deep in the sauce, yeah, sure, pour some fucking vodka in your ass. Actually, she does appear later, doesn't she? I feel like we're spoiling this whole movie. You don't need to watch the movie. <laughs> Just listen to the podcast. <laughs> it's been out for an hour. It's been out, it's been out for an hour. <laughs> My barometer for age is whatever PewDiePie is, if I'm younger than that. <laughs> Am I still yeah. younger than PewDiePie? You're always younger than. Imagine one day you catch up to him. Unless he dies horrifically soon, then <laughs> yeah. you'll pass him an age. Which we don't want to have happen, by the way, well, just want to point that out. I mean, speak for yourself. I've had a vendetta against PewDiePie. <laughs> Ever since he called me that slur on the bridge. <laughs> <laughs> that was me, you know. <laughs> I was playing against him. Yeah, did they ever find the guy who that was directed at? That'd be what really if it funny. was Alex? Just, he's played on online games twice in his life and first he sees Keemstar and then he sees PewDiePie. <laughs> Just those two moments. <laughs> Someone should do like a fake documentary like coming forward like it was them and they've like been living with yeah. the PTSD ever since yeah. or something. <laughs> that would be super funny. If he, yeah, be. He's like Forrest Gump. He's just in the background of every major like YouTube scandal. <laughs> he, he just keeps appearing in like bits of YouTube history <laughs> and like fucking things up by accident. It. I always think about, you ever watched that movie? Was it Coco? Coco Melon? The fucking, was it the... <laughs> Pixar one about the uh, about Doplex yeah about the Mexicans yeah yeah but like the idea in that where it's like you live as long as the last person who remembers you which oh, I don't know right. it's exclusive to that movie but yeah. like that idea but it was <clears throat> it was shown quite well in that movie and it, I, they do they do be get me thinking sometimes like yeah. what if what if uh, what if we be living longer because we've uploaded. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Beef Boys uh, <laughs> play Elden Ring co-op and that just yeah. that gets lodged in someone's brain for a slightly yeah. longer. As long as someone's watching Beef Boys Elden Ring co-op we'll live specifically <laughs> that we'll live. forever. Yeah. I, was talk I was talking to uh, some friends about uh, Dune the book and movie phenomenon Dune. And the sound. Um, and apparently there's a reference in it to like like they I guess there's references to Earth at some point, but it's, you know it's obviously like way far in the future. Oh. Like and none of them, none of them are on Earth anymore. Uh, it's, it's, I think you're saying they reference Earth. Like, hey, you know that planet? <laughs> Dirt. That really well, no, cool they do, planet. right? Because yeah, they talk ground. about. <laughs> But they talk about like his, they're like talking about like history from back back when humanity lived on Earth or whatever. Yeah. And one of them like talks about Hitler. Like one of the main characters talks about Hitler and says like, from what he's a pretty cool you know, guy. He, well, he kind of <laughs> compares himself to Hitler, and I was kind of thinking uh, like if several oh. hundred because we're we're so recent. Like Hitler's yeah. so recent in our timeline that we know people who know people who you know fought in the wars and shit, or have grandparents or great grandparents, whatever. Yeah. But like you think back several, you know, like Genghis Khan, he was like. Hitler times like a hundred. Like he was like the biggest piece of shit ever. Yeah. But now dudes fucking like Wall Street guys are like, yeah, you gotta you gotta hustle like <laughs> Genghis Khan. Do you reckon in like five hundred years or thousand years when like all this shit so ancient history, people be like, damn, Hitler was motivated. Hashtag <laughs> hashtag squad. I mean goals. you already have people just like that. Like, yeah, well, I mean, true. I know Jews died, but like he invented microphones, I think. So I mean so. <laughs> what's the trade off there? Like you know I but mean I, I think there's a little bit more like, like Go ahead, go ahead, sorry. I was, just, I was just wondering, I was like, I wonder how edgy the podcast is and we're talking about Hitler like 10 minutes <laughs> That's a good point, uh, yeah. I, Okay, that's good. Yeah. That's good. That's a good barometer. <laughs> you passed like the YouTube monetization 30 second yeah. part. <laughs> yeah. I saw a post on the PewDiePie subreddit the other day that was like, is a picture of a... Uh, of like him holding his son. It wasn't like a huge post, but it was like, is there something wrong with PewDiePie? Is he sick? Because it was a picture <laughs> of him holding his son but uh -huh. his pupils were like different sizes and he was like what does that mean is he di is he sick and dying <laughs> and then but it was like it was like in earnest it wasn't like a, a meme it was like yeah. a, it was like a little kid and someone re replied and was like no like if you put your hand over your eye like your pupil will shrink and the other one won't it's he probably just like you know was in a dark room or some shit yeah like and the kid was like okay but does that is that was he sick though or is he okay <laughs> <laughs> is he gonna die? Is he yeah, he's okay? fine. He's is he going favorite. to survive? I love him. <laughs> is this child going to be fatherless?
There's something funny about like kids in like 2023, like fucking skibbity toilets, you know, yeah, yeah. alpha kids like stumbling across like skibbity toilet players okay? amnesia. Yeah. Like from 15 years ago, and they're just like, guys, have you seen this? <laughs> <laughs> the whole thing starts again. <laughs> Time uh, truly is a flat circle. Hey, and speaking of, welcome Jay, aka uh, Planet Dolphin. Fish <laughs> filet. <laughs> Planet you get us confused so many people with that. Yeah. Oh, also, no, we're already so, confused, don't please. Yeah, so, so many people are actually confused about that. Yeah. Too. It's so, funny. So, a bit of context. Um, but I, this has been like, weeks all right weeks kudos was saying he was hanging out with dolan and for some reason like i i'm i'm familiar with you i've been watching your stuff for years but for some weird fucking reason when he said dolan i my brain immediately went to planet dolan like the fucking uh <laughs> top 10 youtuber from 2014 i was like does oh, he even guy. exist anymore well th so that's the thing i went to his channel because i thought i thought he was coming on and i went to his channel like like wait this guy hasn't uploaded in like a year <laughs> what's so doing very much I mean, dolan hasn't uploaded in, in two years either that's so. true oh yeah on the on the main channel yeah yeah yeah, yeah. yeah it's probably like True. three years now yeah but like i had to clarify with kudos i was like so is it this guy i just want to make sure and no, he yeah, said no and i thought he was fucking with me and then when he told me it was, yeah. he was like oh of course what the fuck is wrong with me yeah it's funny like the three of us were excited and you just had to sit there like with a smile on your face like oh i really don't want to talk to this fucking nerd <laughs> top, top 10 fucking top 10 youtuber <laughs> Yeah. I still get the occasional com comment being like, wait, what happened to Dolan? He used to do top 10, then he did memes, now he doesn't upload. I'm just like, what that's not me. <laughs> it's still in our solar so system. Funny. How fucked would it be if that guy like got done for like touching kids or something? Because like, you, you would catch 50% of the flame. I was about to say, yeah. it could work well the other way if I like kill someone and manslaughter charge. Yeah. He gets yeah. all the flag. It wasn't for like yeah. a guy on Twitter whose name was Jeffrey Epstein and he was like getting fucking heat oh, for... Yeah. Like from a lot of very confused people. Yeah, that's cancel culture for you guys. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can't share a name with a famous. <laughs> How is this duck still allowed to walk free? Didn't he rape people? <laughs> Didn't he hang himself in a jail cell? How did he survive? Yeah, that happened. That happened like. like 20 years ago, too, there's a guy named Osama bin Laden in a hole in Afghanistan, but it was just a completely different guy. <laughs> Every day people would walk by Fuck, and kick got the wrong on Osama shit. bin Laden. Yeah. yeah, it's really sad. Planet bin Laden. <laughs> top he does 10 top drone 10 list. strikes. That's what, that's what would have happened if we didn't blow up all those children at those weddings in, in Iran. <laughs> there, there is kind of a funny oh. like a th irony, but like there is a possibility that Osama would have had a Twitter account if he didn't get fucking obliterated. That is true. Yeah, he was he was he was pretty uh pretty, you think his, pretty hip with the memes. You think his kids had a Twitter account and like they found out he died because The Rock tweeted fucking yo I just got some <laughs> crazy news. America's <laughs> finally in the clear. <laughs> Whatever you fucking do. I, I, saw, uh, I saw John Cena was the one who announced oh, it. Yeah, <laughs> John Cena and The Rock were both yeah. the first yeah. people to know like, that we killed wrestling. Osama Bin Laden. <laughs> yeah, he's got the inside scoop. <laughs> George Bush was a huge WWE fan. Or it was Obama <laughs> he by that point. Him personally. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, yeah. when you think about it, what Make better way sure to get the John word out Cena than, knows. than through the true. most reputable source of news, the WWE, which is probably where most Americans do yeah. have their news, to be fair. It was very patriotic at the time, you know, like a lot of Americans. Yeah, in 2011. Yeah. Do you remember any of the stuff they found on his computer? Do you remember, like, they said he had, like, Charlie bit my finger and stuff? Yeah. Any of that stuff? Yeah, oh, yeah, and he yeah. like, Tom and Jude. Didn't he have, like, anime in a 3DS or something? Is yeah. it all, like, a 2DS? Yeah, I remember he had, like, he had, like F and Final shit. Fantasy VII. So I yeah. just remember him sitting there playing it. <laughs> like, damn, he never got to see the remake, man. Fucking <laughs> rip it. Rest in peace. Yeah, rip like Osama those... Bin Laden, you would have loved the remake. Yeah. yeah. James, can <laughs> and we get a... remake part two. Can we get a randomizer effect for Osama Bin Laden discovering the Final Fantasy 7 remake in heaven. <laughs> yeah. Controversial oh, opinion. He's in heaven. <laughs> that, was, that would be him. That, that was him realizing they were remaking his favorite game. Yeah. <laughs> there was a weird thing about that where, um, because it was like, I guess, stolen, well, not stolen, it was taken evidence. Stolen Dark? But, oh my oh, god! My favorite guest, <laughs> um, because the uh, because like the it was taken by the U.S. government and was some big thing. Like I guess they had to declassify it at a certain point, mm. but it also meant that they had Ned. to like they uploaded everything that was on it for the public to see. So and I think because he had like a hundred episodes of Tom and Jerry or some shit. <laughs> 
Like, and I guess oh, that man. circumvents copyright law. He was you can leave he got the watch. idea for 9 11. He watched the Tom and Jerry <laughs> bit and was like, that's funny. <laughs> I'm going to fly a big plane. He originally wanted the plane to fly two feet away from him, and then a big mallet comes out and bonks it. Yeah, well, he wanted the plane to like screech in the air and everything compress yeah. and warm. <laughs> <laughs> and like scratch That's how he found out real life works differently to tune. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God damn it. <laughs> yeah, he didn't, he didn't. Can you imagine if, if his first terrorist attack was he painted a big hole on like a wall <laughs> and like a road through it? <laughs> 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 like cars crash into it. He, he, he paints like the Twin Towers to look like clouds. <laughs> 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 Welcome to the Beat Boys Podcast, Jay. You're here. You know, you're queer. We're all hanging out. It's just the boys. Nice little cheeky Monday yeah. Are you Lucky guys monetized? Uh, uh, mostly. Not for long. Sort of. <laughs> not the last like seven episodes. They've all got yeah. they've all got yeah. Oh, you actually got demonetized? Yeah. 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 Yeah, we have, yeah. Well, pretty much. Just, just limited ads, but yeah. we, we we started to enact a strict one p <laughs> reference per episode, which I which just, you blew. just broke. Uh, yeah. So yeah. um so that's that's, uh, so that's I don't know if over. that's helped at all. <laughs> yeah, we we had a good run on my podcast. I think we had ten episodes green, and then w- oh, wow. last episode went yellow, and it was we were like, why did that happen? And then we're like, oh yeah, we did talk about children playing Frogger in traffic, like, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <laughs> among other things, among yeah. other things. Yeah. Just good yeah. clean fun. It's good yeah. clean fun. You know, it's, it's got to learn. Kind of like, like what car company wouldn't want to slap an ad right after that? Exactly. <laughs> it's, just, it's, just, it's like it's just perfect placement. It just makes sense. Well, hey, hey, that's been that's been the uh, welcome to the Beat Boys blue check yeah, mark one of the week. Tough. The the whole the whole thing this week's been like dash cam footage of some fucking toddler like running into a road and getting like either hit by a car or almost hit by a car. Yeah. I can't remember. They get they get doinked. I think I haven't seen. And then just it's just to see a blue checks being like, um, maybe the child shouldn't be playing. <laughs> maybe the street. child should have eyes. They can see the fucking yeah. truck. Dude, I've seen some dumb <laughs> blind if that was bitch. A, if that was a Tesla, at least it would have sped up and killed it faster. It would just like be in pain. Yeah. <laughs> killed it. It would have pulled out a knife and stabbed it in the heart. <laughs> it's just it's referring to it as an it because it's not verified on Twitter. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, they do the Teslas like constantly mistake children for like bollards. <laughs> like for some reason they're like they're like we need to change. Yeah, they're like bowling towards pins. It. <laughs> <laughs> We need to eradicate it from this road. It plays a really funny bowling animation on inside the car. <laughs> Strike! Strike. Right. Nice cock. Nice. Perfect. Do you do you think that's like on a jailbroken Tesla? Like someone's made that an app. <laughs> like it plays low animation when you when you play. Yeah, someone that says nice cock. <laughs> <laughs> that's the sort of shit that like Elon someone would tweet saying that, and then it'll be like, great idea. We put this. Yeah, looking, looking, and then looking into this. Yeah, <laughs> and then the programmer, yeah. the programmer at Tesla gets that on his fucking memo, and it's like you have to do this by the end of the day, and it's like five p.m. and he's yeah. like. <sighs> he just ends it, kills himself on the spot. <laughs> you know how he stands in front of a Tesla. <laughs> you know how hackers can like walk past everyone in a food store and like three DS absorb all their R- RFID chips on their like credit cards. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like they have so. Like w- when's it? Like are we gonna get to a point where if someone could just like walk up to a Tesla and give them like target children like RFID? That's <laughs> already on the Tesla though. Yeah, well, yeah. 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 Still, in an hand, you just have to like, unlock it. Yeah. yeah, they just like I w- I don't know. I wonder because if someone could just like walk up and hack the software and be like, "All right, as soon as you see a dog go seventy five miles an hour directly at it, don't stop until you feel the back disable the brakes and make sure it dies. Play the funny ba da ba 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 da ba da ba 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 on your horn, and then make all the doors do that dance thing that they do if you if you tell it to. If you kill a child, yeah, yeah it's like a Fortnite dance. There's a there's a Twitter account called the Internet of Shit, which I found when I was doing my like, like one of my Silicon Valley videos, mm. and it's just talking about all the awful like overproduced fucking like w- unnecessary tech drilled into things. Where someone I don't know if they posted it or someone else posted it, but it was a bin that you need to download an app to unlock, <laughs> like uh, like a street bin. <laughs> And it's oh like, bro, I'm not downloading an app oh for my a God. bin. Dude, my fucking dishwasher has an app, and it's like, <laughs> you wash dishes. Why do you need an app? It's like the oh, stupidest my, my fucking lo- thing ever. Can you still tweet from fridges? I know you could. <laughs> oh, yeah. There's like, a, yeah. there's like a tweet of someone who got grounded, and they tweeted from their Samsung fridge. <laughs> like, fridge. I don't know if yeah. this is going to work, but mom took my phone. Who was like <laughs> the big, awesome. yeah, the, wasn't Keemstar like a big proponent of that? 
he had like a whole thing for like a yeah yeah he had a whole thing for like a year where he would like he would like flex on people and ratio them and then like put it on his fridge and take a picture of him oh, tweeting yeah. on his fridge. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I would have <laughs> wouldn't be surprised. That sounds like such a keem stuff. Yeah, it's, <laughs> fucking, it's like when you're like seven years old, you think that's sick as fuck. God, ratio place, from my Samsung refrigerator. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. I wish we still had that on tweets, like having where things were sent from, because I feel like it's just a it says Earth now because Elon's the most a dork. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's on the phone. Reddit, Reddit, brain Reddit idiot. Reddit from 2010. Yeah. Uh, it's from, you Earth. from Earth. You know he's going to take his stupid fucking penis rocket into space and fucking tweet something just so it could say space. Yeah. I, I think that moon. was the idea, right? To tweet from yeah. Mars. Even yeah. Though, like, oh, that makes sense. He, apparently we're meant to be in Mars in 2020 based on his tweets from like 10 years ago. So <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how like, that's going. Yeah. I guess I said coronavirus will make... be over in a month. But... <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's, uh, that's right. And it was because it didn't exist, right? Yeah, that's, yeah it is right. fake. Yeah. 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 Oh, and there goes, there goes monetization again. <laughs> This will for anyway. sure be monetized. Yeah, yeah this is. This is <laughs> yeah, you Dolan? know who else is dark? Dolan. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Oh, oh, look at that! Oh. Tell us your uh, what's your uh, credit card number? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> let me let me get it. Real quick. All right, cool. Thanks. <laughs> I was gonna say I went when I, I went on the Super Mega podcast like ages Swag. ago, probably yeah. four yeah, years ago. Compare? And they asked, "This is." I don't know. I wasn't offered drugs on this one. So. <laughs> <Yo>! <laughs> I, um, I unfortunately didn't make the cut, but they were like, they just asked me my address, and I just straight up told them my exact address. <laughs> Said it. But just put it in. They didn't make the cut. <laughs> yeah, I can't, can't imagine why. Can you imagine if they did leave it in, like on set? <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah. Like, yeah. Bit. <laughs> Just well, well, he said it. You. Yeah. Some guy comes and stabs you because he hated your fucking. I hey, saw you on parodies. Super Mega. It's like Chad leaving fucking whatever his name's nuts in the fucking Patreon video. Oh, lovely. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, lovely. <laughs> Fucking I still don't understand how Chad messed that up. Like it was, he literally <laughs> said no. Take that out. I think it's because like, oh. he said, doesn't he say no, ha ha ha? So Chad was like, he yeah. said ha ha ha. That's a yes. That's so <laughs> that's, I assume that's, that's how. That's, it that's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't the same thing happen on Super Mega, but it was a bit like it was not a bit. It was um one of the audience did this like perfect Photoshop that yeah, genuinely they made it look Meat like Canyon's someone's nuts. nuts. Yeah. yeah, it was it was but Meat it was, Canyon. Yeah, and, and was, Meat Canyon messaged them behind the scenes. It was like, "Yo, can you guys please take that fucking video down and re-edit it and put it up?" Like, and the Super Mega was like freaking out, and then fucking they found out it was just a fucking it's, it was just an edit. It's yeah, a really it is, good Photoshop. Yeah. It, it, it looked Fuck good because it, it didn't look like it wasn't like a big pair of fucking it was sweaty really nuts good. hanging out. Yeah. It was like it was like he was wearing like, like so fucking basketball shorts or whatever, and then yeah. like you, it was like you could see directly up his like right thigh, and you just yeah. saw like a bit of you saw like a fold of skin that looked like it would probably be balls, but like it wasn't you know it wasn't <laughs> yeah. like he had big juicy nuts. The shadow was all it, right yeah. and everything. Yeah, it all it yeah. all looked legit. <laughs> Someone That's spent a, a lot of time show photoshopping. How that recent yeah. was it? Maybe maybe they used AI if it was recent. <laughs> uh, uh, I'd say a little over a year ago, probably. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay. Train an yeah. AI model and pairs of nuts for like <laughs> yeah. Yeah. on perfectly <laughs> shadowed <laughs> balls. Uh, yes, Mid Journey. Could you please add some uh, freshly shaven nuts <laughs> to <balls>. this man's? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're like what fucking. Like a, uh, you're like Tony Stark. Like uh, Mid Journey. Uh, and this guy's balls. <laughs> Jarvis, give him balls. What if, what if they're like a, a like a flasher, and they just wanted a way to like show their like he composited his own balls, and he just wanted oh, no. a way to show <laughs> his own balls to as many people as possible. This is his legacy. This is yeah. his legacy. <laughs> I love that. Everyone idea. thinks he's a memer, yeah. but he just really wants to show people his nuts. Yeah, he's got a humiliation <laughs> kink. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Everyone in the comments is like, man, Meat Cane is fucking disgusting nuts. And this guy's like, oh, so he's fucking like, ugly. Oh. I think it's infected. <laughs> Meat Cane is nuts. It's like they are dying. <laughs> <laughs> rotting off. Number 15. Meat Canyon rotting balls. Meat Canyon's rotting balls. Meat Canyon's You might think the scariest cock. thing about Meat Canyon is his cartoons, but in reality, <laughs> his balls the real shocker lies in his shorts. Do you guys his have a favorite chills? Nut? 
sentence a favorite chill <laughs> sentence oh yeah. in, in this, fucking uh, i like clash. having sex with children that's my <laughs> that's favorite so one that he, <laughs> he did say that was that that's really good. him was that a voice that was that a voice <laughs> yeah that was, on the, that was on the guy <laughs> sampled yeah no, i like yeah. it i like in creator clash when he's like so tell us it's like <laughs> no yeah him in creator clash was like everything tell us yeah <laughs> <laughs> it's so fucking funny. He flew, did he throw some inflection on it? <laughs> he usually doesn't have any fucking. He, he was, no, yeah, yeah. It, was yeah. A, it was a lot more normal than he, he appears in his videos. But yeah. I just I remember the first creative clash was so fucking funny because like having chills is such a funny meme. But yeah. then like iDubs was so like focused and serious and like, obviously like nervous and stressed about being like the fucking big fight of of a like massive uh boxing yeah. competition or whatever but so i just remember that that the variant it was so funny because like he was getting interviewed by chills after his fight and there's just this juxtaposition of like here's chills which would have been invent was like <laughs> idubs and goofy like fuck around me modes like six months ago and now here's idubs like dead serious like exhausted just had to fucking like the most nerve-wracking yeah. moment of his life and just hit, having those two ideas clash was had me so, tell us. so. Okay. <laughs> i remember one that was like honestly if i saw that damn thing in my <laughs> living room i would squish oh, it till it's a little brown, brown stain, stain. <laughs> that, that's oh, from uh, that's from uh, a psychic people's videos i think psychic people's like commissioned that wait really uh, I, thought it was, I thought I it was, was an actual no nah, yeah. i think no it's from um i think it is anyway it's it's from schmucks like when psychic people did a podcast for a few episodes yeah um oh, okay that's so interchangeable that it's believable like, yeah because well, i, think I remember the, the video it looked like a little baby thing that was like yeah, running so so that was the thing the that, I, that psychic people was edited together yet yeah, so it was like <laughs> he was funny. reacting to like a little goblin man or whatever oh. <laughs> the, the joke being oh, the psychic so, people so he the just goblin. voiced it as well like oh. it wasn't just did, did you know, chills did chills, no, chills do the voice it. yeah chills did the voice okay. yeah, yeah. i think the whole gag was that like the the podcast went on hiatus for like several months and then they yeah. were like talking about it as though it was this like lost media like this this uh, mysterious honestly. creature psychic pebbles <laughs> my life is a fucking lie yeah, i know this yeah. is like breaking my brain right now <laughs> I would Breaking stop bad. on it until it was a little brown stain. I, I liked what? his cameo in uh, Smiling Friends as well, where they like they walk into a cafe oh, yeah. and he's like this this I fucking gremlin that. creature, and he's yeah. like number fifteen. Can I please get <laughs> the number, number fifteen? 15. <laughs> Dude, I forgot about that. Shout, Shout out, out chills. chills. It's pretty. It's pretty impressive to basically own a number. Like I don't know if people like you can say fifteen anymore without being like number fifteen. It's like Among Us. It's like it's yeah. exactly tick something yeah. in your brain and yeah. he got fifteen. Uh, He's Mr. like Bucky the Michael got 19, Jordan of fifteen. He got the nineteen dollar <laughs> Fortnite card. Yeah, <laughs> the Germans have nine. They can keep that. Yeah, I was actually uh, I was thinking about this the other day. Isn't it crazy how are six million I think Germans? Germans, <laughs> Germans have a few other numbers, don't they? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fourteen, right. eighty-eight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking about this the other day. Like, is I it a crazy a how song. Among Us, right? Among Us, the, the term "Among Us" was like us. fucking altered in our vocabulary for you know for the foreseeable <laughs> future us. because of this game that I'm not sure anybody even plays anymore. You know what I mean? Like, it was such a fad that it like warped our our fucking when we say it. We we see people, something yeah. else. It's Can't it's been like it a anymore. long-standing meme though, because people will still post like pictures of like things that look like Among Us characters on Twitter. Oh sure, like, yeah. Have you seen the <laughs> image that's like Discord Among Us Jews? It's oh like, yeah, it's Discord, like a newspaper Discord. clipping from like 1987, and it's like Discord <laughs> Among you like usa, USA. jews yeah. it's just like ah yeah no, i did see that yeah there's Three someone like this <laughs> someone does the the, the fucking uh, sound alikes thing yeah. yeah discord among us jews <laughs> Man, <funny. laughs> it's so funny it's from 1982 what? just like <laughs> they what knew. did they know they, yeah they predicted it the newspapers predicted among us and discord there were some of those, and jews wasn't there like a tweet from like 2012 or something like where it was just some guy saying like, oh, it was something like Among Us or Sus or something. It was some Among Us reference. And then he says like, you'll get this joke in 10 years. It was yeah, something I wasn't weird sure like if, that. Yeah, wasn't that like edited? Like, wasn't that- Among Yeah, I've, seen, I've seen a lot of edited memes like that. Like, yeah. I think mm. for Among Us as well and other memes, I'll just pretend like someone tweeted it like seven years ago. Yeah, yeah. I'm pretty sure even Keemstar did that. Like, I remember Keemstar had a tweet from like 
2017 that was like COVID-19 in 2020. Oh, yeah. It was yeah. like yeah. something well, no, like a that. big buzzword. Yeah. I think he was, he, that was a genuine tweet from them, but that was because like COVID or coronavirus has been around for like years. Like yeah. it was just, it was the specific was like, variant that we dealt with, but like. Yeah, but it was yeah. like a hyper, it was like a hyper specific tweet. It was like, it was something like that. My favorite was like the blatantly fake ones that would be like, don't go to the theater tomorrow, Abraham, tweeted from like 1887. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <Just> like, <laughs> like, is this real, guys? Did he really tweet this? <laughs> you just know that like some teachers have been, have used that like, right, imagine if Twitter existed in the 1880s, what tweets would you see? <laughs> Sent from a rotary so phone. Do you reckon oh, in the 1880s yeah. there'd be more or less inwards than after Elon took over Twitter? <laughs> they, were, they were doing more than saying it. Like, yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> yeah, there's there's like other things that went along with it. Yeah, right. I can't remember what they were though. Yeah, I know. But, I'm sure they uh, were bad. Uh, yeah. I feel like they would be so <laughs> flabbergasted by what a fucking, like, what any of that is if you just plop Twitter in front of them. They would just, like, have to tweet a slur. Yeah. <laughs> like, what, is, oh. what else, what else are you going to say when you're that I mean, surprised? That's function. Imagine telling <laughs> yeah, you exactly. Like, Magic glowing box can reach like millions of people. That just yeah. be like, huh? <laughs> yeah, say anything, and a million people will see it right now. Just type it. Just type it in. Let's take that a step further. You could say anything, and it goes into a million people's heads randomly. Like they just hear uh, discord yeah. among U.S. Well, Jews well, over Israel seems to grow. <laughs> <laughs> you just said that. I, yeah. to, I would honestly. <laughs> I, I feel like people would either do like self promote because you just instantly become like. People would yeah. think you're a god. Rising yeah. you just, I'd just say something to like scare the shit out of them. <laughs> <It's> like, I, <laughs> well, I think Bye. this is the thing. I feel like, like you'd hey, want to do that. Really, really pay attention to your heartbeat right now and, and really pay attention to how little you're breathing. <laughs> everyone, in the, everyone in the world has you're a dying. panic attack. <laughs> yeah. Tell them to like invest all their money in like some shit coin you just made. <laughs> oh, <laughs> just yeah. Dogecoin. Pump and, Dude, pump and dump that would it. work so yeah. fucking well though. Dude, fucking people go crazy. If Elon even just tweets the word doge, everyone's like, <gasps> he's sending signals. Hurry, money. buy the dip. He's doge whistling. <laughs> Hit the child. <laughs> doge whistling. Hit the child. <laughs> <laughs> nice cock. <laughs> yeah, that's what I would say to everybody. Mask. Hit the child. <laughs> Hit the child. <laughs> yeah, hit the child. <laughs> kill your son. Kill the babe. Yeah. <laughs> oh yeah, actually, how many people would kill themselves if you just if you just if that was the one thing you said? Kill yourself. Kill you. I'm God. <laughs> I'm God in your head. Kill yourself now. I want you to be with me. Or just play the soundbite of Come low tier home. God saying, "Kill yourself now." <laughs> <laughs> I feel like you'd have a lot of pretty manic people just jump in the gun and be like, "Well, okay." Yeah. Well, <laughs> it'd be a mixture of like, manic me people and like. Like evangelical Christians who are like, yes. Well, I heard Suicide the voice of God. Suicide isn't a sin so, anymore. Yeah. Come to me, my children. Yeah. Yes, right away. <laughs> like, I thought the, I thought the rapture was going to be a bit different, but here we go. <laughs> and you'd, you'd, you'd have no proof either. There'd just be a million people claiming this happened, and you'd be like, <laughs> yeah. Are you yeah. just gaslighting like a mass gaslight? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Everyone that a... doesn't kill themselves gaslights all the people whose family killed themselves. Like, yeah, I didn't hear anything in my head. <laughs> 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 you know, fucking yeah. crazy man. You fucking. They're in therapy, weirdo. and they're like, but I did hear something I heard just it. have to do something to deal with the guilt the speaking of uh evangelical christians andrew you might have seen this so maybe the other boys might have as well but did you see that woman on uh, twitter today who was talking about uh <laughs> when her and her husband go to see oppenheimer or any movie that has sex scenes in it and how they deal with that okay i've been i'm glad you brought this up because i haven't been able to articulate my feelings on that on twitter in any way it's just very funny to me Having grown up, you know, uber Christian and like, oh, I don't watch any boobs. They're scary. Were you it's molested? very funny that <laughs> the <laughs> sex <are> scary. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, were you molested? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> uh, Define molest. <laughs> it comes with the baptism. <laughs> it's like a two for one. Very name is Father, Son, Holy Spirit, and then like, hey, they put two. They put two fingers up here and then dip you like a puppet. <laughs> oh my god! I like how dip you like a candy I, I like how I thought I went too far and then it just gets just triple, triple down. <laughs> That's kind of the nature of this podcast. Actually, uh, James, oh. give us uh, Andrew's baptism on the randomizer. Yeah. Yeah, what did I what did I feel like? <sighs> Delete me from this conversation. <laughs> that is, uh, literally That's me. Kudo said stick yeah. two fingers in a baby's ass. <laughs> Delete Specifically me from this conversation. Andrew's. 
Uh, <laughs> okay, that's cool. <laughs> <Is it breaks? laughs> well, okay, actually, just for clarity, uh, for my baptism, uh, what I did, I wasn't a baby for the baptism. That's a that's a Catholicism <laughs> meme. Uh, yeah, I, you know, I, it's it's much better <laughs> that he would do it to like a, a teenager. Yeah, my, anyway, my my, my uh, senior yeah. at my Catholic church was like Jeff better Dunham. Friend. <laughs> <laughs> and I was his puppet made, that morning. He made James say, "I kill you." <laughs> he made James into a racist caricature yeah. on the spot. Yeah, yeah. And his whole family's like for every person. <laughs> Along. <laughs> no, but the sex scene discourse is very funny to me because it's very obviously being propagated by like fourteen-year-olds on Twitter who are like, it, "It added nothing to the plot," and now all these goofy Christians are like. <gasps> Now's our chance. Now finally, <laughs> the world is seeing it our way. And it's, I'm like, what? What was the take on Twitter that you were referring to? Yeah. Oh, the uh, take was basically yes. sex scenes in movies are evil. And it's weird to me uh, okay. because I'm like, yeah. since when did everybody adopt like these boomer ass Christian ideals on sex scenes of movies? Yeah. Well, I, I saw one thing. Boobs that are I kinda, cool. <laughs> first of all, boobs are cool. Shout out boobs. Second, like, the, the, the theory that I saw that I, I like is that. Um, because of like rising house prices and shit, there's more people living with their parents than before. Ooh. And so therefore oh, people right. forced, forced oh. to sit and watch movies with their with parents. Their mom so, like, and daddy. <laughs> yeah, because if you're just chilling at home watching a movie and a sex scene comes on, it's you're too like too awkward. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That is but, yeah. but as soon as your mom's there, you're like I don't wait, <sighs> don't can, what was what was the peop what was that couple's solution or whatever? Uh, well, so I, I, it's a, it's like Final a minute solution. Half yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it was this, it's this very Christian woman who has a Jesus fish tatter on her wrist, which I think is also against, you're not meant yeah. to do that in the Bible, but whatever. And she was talking about how every time she goes see a movie or play or anything, they like her and her husband research the shit out of it to make sure that there's no like, nothing too bad in it but i really want to see oppenheimer anyway so yeah. they were like okay we'll just deal with it and what what the solution was was every time there was boobs on screen her husband would close oh, his no. eyes and rest his face on her shoulder <laughs> and then she would let him know when it's over why doesn't why does she want to see the boobs yeah. that's fucking why does she to watch it, it? yeah uh yeah that's exactly. a greater sin than than seeing boobism <laughs> than lust yeah yeah I don't know. I don't uh, believe that, God but from the, from the eyes of... <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> she, she should close her eyes. Yeah. yeah. I think and put, like, put I, like a fucking scrub daddy up her pussy. Make sure it's fucking... <laughs> <laughs> turn it to wet down there. You pull it out, and pussy. if there's any moisture on it, you're like, She gets to punch it. When you squeeze well, it apparently, too now. Apparently, darling, you're they do moist. that because <laughs> the, uh, the husband... Uh, traumatized her by secretly watching porn. Um, so now he has to look away from all boobs. Yeah, he's not allowed. So for anybody who's like hardcore in the no sex scenes, it was that's the who devil you're that aligning with. me to watch yeah. fucking a four-way BBC Bukaki fucking cup shot compilation. <laughs> the devil put my cock in my hand in that movie theater during the What if when he's resting his head, head on the, his shoulder, he's just looking down at top of the tits <laughs> yeah. in my head? Oh, like, oh. he's, just, he's, he's just imagining Florence Pugh's beautiful BBC <laughs> yeah. titties. Yeah. He's catching yeah, I mean, the reflection you, it, off her necklace. It is literally crucifix. guaranteed that he goes home and looks up Florence Pugh's Oppenheimer boobs. Yeah. yeah. Exactly <laughs> like going to. See yeah. what he's missing. <laughs> He goes into the bathroom and he like puts like a towel under the fucking door and shit. So just, yeah. just really lock off the vacuum yeah. seal the whole room. And then he like <laughs> seal from sin. He, he tuning he, to fucking he, movie scene, sex <laughs> scenes. It's just like the most mid shit ever. He just got it all on his voice. He's like, got American oh, Pie over here, American Pie oh. Two over here. <laughs> He's got American Pie One again. Scooby Doo over yeah. here. <laughs> oh, I love when Jason Biggs fucks the pie. It gets me so hard. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway, that's a healthy relationship. It's, I don't know. I just thought that. I just thought the that was funny. stupid anyway, because I remember seeing people make fun of it. Like, why do they add gunfights to action movies? They add nothing to the plot. You know, <laughs> yeah. like yeah. yeah. If you took out shit that didn't add to the plot, you'd have just have like no cinematography. It'd just exactly. be like yeah, a fucking a, four minute book. video. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Oppenheimer yeah. let the bomb off. The end. Thanks. Yeah, read a book <laughs> also, and just white, white out the lines about boobs. 
You're yeah. all good, bro. <laughs> you see Logan Paul's take about the movie? Did you oh, see that has, come up you on see Logan Paul's sex oh, scene in the movie? <laughs> <laughs> Little cameo. He's just yeah. sitting, he's just sitting yeah, Logan Paul because there was Peck. too much talking. Yeah. I just, he, he played what Oppenheimer's cock. If Oppenheimer slept with more people, I reckon he would have liked it, though. You know, you know I, yeah, I, yeah. I, I, I yeah. bet he was one of those... I bet he was one of those oh, guys at, at my theater. I had like like probably ten or fifteen, like just dudes, just dude bros, walk out as soon as the nuke scene was over. And there's like a whole, there's like <laughs> another forty five minutes of like the political <laughs> aftermath and the actual narrative yeah. of the movie. And like right. just as soon as the nuke scene was over, you're two you're two hours into a three hour movie that just like fifteen frat bros got up and walked out. And well, I, I bet Logan Paul did the exact same thing. Maybe they had to go catch Barbie. <laughs> <laughs> The bomb awesome. went, and they were like, okay, I'm out. <laughs> It'd be funny if that dude's wife gets to watch porn, but his and he just has to sit there with his head on her shoulder like the whole time. Yeah, he can only <laughs> listen. DJing her yeah. shit, and he's just yeah. like yeah. on her shoulder <laughs> listening to Yeah. <laughs> he's just gonna, he can only listen he's to getting the gushing digitally pussy. cucked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> She's watching like fucking black.com, and he's just like, Yeah. <laughs> yes, I hear it, honey. He's <laughs> just humiliating himself. <laughs> Yeah, well, to be fair, I think I actually yes, think uh, sweetie, babe, it's bigger than I, mine. I think I think not being able to watch Florence Pugh titties and Oppenheimer and having to like fucking uh, shield your eyes like you're, <laughs> you're fucking like you're a child old. watching a gory movie with, with yeah. your dad uh, is like more embarrassing. Than <laughs> yeah, be, so being cut by a black dot com. Yeah, honestly, I guess it sounds like a bitch. Well, she offs herself yeah, at the end, so his wife doesn't even have to worry about it. <laughs> yeah, it's true. Don't, don't worry, honey. Dead. She killed herself. It's okay. No. <laughs> you don't have to. You're not gonna fall totally into sin. Totally decrepit right now. They're disgusting. I wouldn't even want them. She's yeah. with Actually, God. she does appear later, doesn't she? Because there's that scene in the interior. I feel like we're spoiling this whole movie. This is, a, this is a fairly new movie. No, you don't need to watch <laughs> the movie. A, man, Just listen to the podcast. Yeah. Yeah. It's been out for an hour. It's been an hour. It's been for like a month. Hour. <laughs> <laughs> like that time we spoiled uh, uh, fucking Alec Baldwin's cool cool new movie, The Second It Happened. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> shooting a woman. <laughs> that shooting happened live while we were recording. A woman. My, my we got our live awesome. Yeah, we got our yeah, live yeah. reaction. We, we were just out of, the note, out of the blues like, <laughs> Alec Baldwin just killed a woman. And we were like, what <laughs> yeah. the fuck? <laughs> I feel like you guys would react. Even I would just like nice quick scope or something. Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Did he get a? Did he get a nuke? It was uh, oh, tra the Travis Scott trample fucking happened while we were recording too. Oh did yeah, yeah, that's true. Oh, yeah, dude. Did it you play like, very shortly some before. horses or something? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. I think we kept spamming. It's lit. It's lit. Yeah, it's lit. Oh. <laughs> it's lit. Sound fight. I think that both of those blah. episodes. Were <laughs> oh, yeah, the wing. Do you know, has this skin been back in the Fortnite store since that happened? Because uh, <laughs> ironically, don't know. they they actually took it off for like. Did, did they, they really? Actually? It was it was scheduled to go out in like memoriam. a day out to go out a day after. That's crazy. And they they took it off the. Does that uh, mean it's now like an Uber rare skin? They like just put it in black and white and yeah. put it back in. Yeah, yeah. And his, his, <laughs> the, the, they changed the emote that comes with it to just like a face palm. <laughs> your character looks good. He's black and white. Yeah. 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 He changed to black and white. Just Dude, you know, you know, they're putting a fucking, they're putting like a full, a fully digital Holocaust museum into Fortnite, like a permanent Holocaust Didn't museum. Yeah. yeah. I think yeah. they're, I think they're disabling the ability to emote. Cause I remember yeah. when they did like a, cause the Martin Luther, Martin Luther, King. Luther King. Yeah. They yeah. did the whipping emotes. And oh, they, yeah. They, <laughs> Yeah, they had to remove so right. many emotes that yeah. you could play it's just because like, of people. It's just like yeah. that, is, that isn't even a, a like, uh, just let video games be video games. Not that I don't think that like art can do like good things, but it's like there is literally nothing good that can come from that and only no. negative. Yeah. Like you're, you're yeah. just like giving a <laughs> no. bunch of kids like they a reason to be rebellious kids. Like about 10 monkey emojis because of what people were doing, right? I feel oh, like it's oh, almost just as just as bad because you're like wait why yeah. were they removed it's like oh. yeah. and then, and then oh. when you remove it it's like, oh, oh, yeah. oh no it's, it's kind of like uh the fucking uh the question of like if you could if you could tweet or if you could whisper anything in anybody's head it's like you give somebody the option to do something <laughs> <Just the inward. laughs> it's gonna go south. like remove the option entirely don't put a holocaust museum don't put it just let it be a fucking video game like yeah, like a, a kid like, is gonna, gonna do no intellectual nourishment from seeing the holocaust yeah. museum in fortnite like teach them about <laughs> yeah, it yeah. in school 
We're all yeah. good. All you're doing is giving, <laughs> like, you're giving, like, a stage to all, like, the edgy assholes, and then everyone looks, all the 10-year-olds look at them, they're like, yo, that's fucking epic, man. <laughs> man. That's so you funny, imagine, like, this Holocaust like, they shot Museum is really sad. on the wall next to fucking, <laughs> fucking <laughs> Let's go. Jew, Jewish guy number seven's picture. Do you I couldn't think was, of a famous do, Jewish guy. Yeah. Oppenheimer. Do you reckon there was, um, <laughs> yeah. do you reckon there was, uh, uh, like any schools that were like, okay, Jewish everyone log into Fortnite today. We're gonna just, today we're doing <laughs> yeah, this. Yeah, come on, kids. Yeah. <laughs> I remember in year, Man, like, this is really sad. Name, and it's like, a, where are we dropping, boys? Woman, and she's trying to be like hip about it and everything. She can't log in. And then she's using like yeah, the touch yeah, screen yeah. on the whiteboard and can't get the fucking buttons to work and shit. Yeah. <laughs> she loads the I'm game up and it's way too loud and blows out the classroom speakers. <laughs> like, that, happened. Happened. that happened to me because we had a, a science class where like, again, this was like, just because I'm a fucking boomer. This was like way before any of those games where you tried that shit. But when we had the science class, we, was, we were in the computer lab instead of the science lab and we we're like, oh, this is weird. Why are we here? And the teacher had this like game that I guess had been made to like teach her about chemistry or some shit. Uh -huh. And it was some like first person game where you like walked around a lab and like you just interacted with fucking beakers and you had to like put take the things and put it, whatever. The it was like, kind of a cool idea. Fucking but I, <laughs> movie I, the I, game. I, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but I specifically remember they um they had an Easter egg where there was like a fire extinguisher on the wall you could pick up and like spray uh -huh. it around. It was like just some dump thing the game did probably put it because yeah. I thought it was funny. But for, for some reason, once you picked up the fire extinguisher, you couldn't put it down. And I remember <laughs> all these kids were picking it up and the teachers that are screaming at people like, don't pick up the fire extinguisher. <laughs> <laughs> she had such a short temper. It was so funny. <laughs> Was it in case your experiment caught on fire or they just added? I know, like, I think it literally was just a, like a little Easter egg. Like, oh, you can go to the thing and pick up the fire extinguisher and like you can spray it for a bit and then it runs out of juice. Yeah. But I literally, that was just, as soon as someone found that out, the whole class started doing it. And then I think yeah. that, it like, yeah, it's like teaching it so mad. <laughs> That's always yeah. the best, like teachers with short tempers. I think I told you guys, like when we had a, we had a substitute who like punched my friend. Hey. What? Yeah. what? I, mean, I didn't tell. I could have started talking about some beef boys. When they go like to jail a, for that? Or no. Like so catch a case. <laughs> very well, illegal. Deserved it. So yeah. Assume. Yeah. Well, so what happened was, was being like, an during, like a lockdown, and like you know, like lockdowns because obviously like, California fucking schools. It was like a. It was like Tommy an yeah, yeah. event of a shooter. Jay don't. Me and Jay don't know about that. That's actually. true. Yeah. Well, so uh, in, like America, shooting in America, lockdowns. we have uh, like shooting drills. And this has been a thing since I was a kid. Like, I remember like they would fucking ring the alarm. It's a drill. Everybody yeah. get under the desks. They lock the door, whatever. And like my fucking friend who was just like, he's just like the biggest piece of shit ever. He, he continued to be a piece of shit. And he was a, re a reason, a big and reason for a lot of my He's here now today on the podcast. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but I remember he like, um, he was just pissing off the fucking substitute teacher like he was just like being loud and being goofy and like the guy fucking comes over to us to like tell him to shut up and he says something back to him he was just like mimicking him and then the substitute teacher straight up just like fucking punched him <laughs> <laughs> and the whole class went silent that's awesome it's, Damn. dude it was he like hunched over <laughs> stupid <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, the, and then he got mad because of my friend was like, that fucking hurt you, bitch. I feel like there was a weird thing with like, I played football and like a lot of the football coaches and assistant coaches were like teachers and shit. And there was a weird thing where like the football coaches could kind of get like physical with. Get a little handsy. With the younger woman. <laughs> <A little> handsy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Because they were hot and played football. No, like, it, like, Did you guys have scandals? Like, oh, physical, sorry, like with, no, they could just get more physical, like with the football kids, because I, I don't know. There's like, I guess a perceived like, yeah, like you know, macho. they're they're more than just a teacher to me. Like they're like yeah. my coach, and I fucked with all my coaches, but I always hated that. It was like they would just try to like bitch you out in the in the front of, in like front of the class because they thought that uh. they could. And it's just like, come on, Mister Henderson. My this guy, Mister Henderson, always used to tell me I would wear like V V necks in high school, fucking 2012 moment, and he'd be yeah. like, Miller, put your hamburger meat away, and everyone would laugh, and I'd be like, Yo, coach, <laughs> <laughs> coach, yeah. Yeah. Oh, fuck. Come on! Come on. <laughs> I was gonna, did you guys have like a um a scandal that stands out from your schools or anything? Oh, man. Like, mm. Or multiple oh. scandals? <laughs> Yo, <laughs> many scandals. Um, God, uh, you, you go first, Dolan. I want to hear if you got any. I almost feel like mine might like docs where I went to school. Oh, but we, oh is it like? We had, oh. I mean, we had we had a lot. Um, I mean. 
not to call them scandals, but we had one year where like four people killed themselves. Jesus, oh, really? Really? so that's a bit of a that's a bit of a knee slapper. Um, the funny, <laughs> that's a good light hearted one. The funnier <laughs> one was like this this girl. So two guys. One was the PE teacher. Who? Uh-huh. What would you call that? Football coach or coach? Like yeah. a gym teacher. Yeah, yeah. Uh, gym, gym teacher. teacher. Yeah. So his son and another guy during school hours, not on not on property. Had sex with a girl, and they put a pool ball up her vagina, what? and she had what? to she, she had to get it surgically removed. Oh and they my got, god! And what they the got fuck? Su- they got suspended because it occurred during school hours. <laughs> like <laughs> got suspended. Some like it was such a it was such a bizarre like occurrence. It, uh, yeah, that's did such you, a weird you punishment of- too. Like you put a pool ball yeah. in his chick's yeah. vagina, you get you can't come to school for two weeks. <laughs> <laughs> it sounded like something that someone would make up, but then like people people were obviously making fun, and making memes about it, and then the girl right. like the girl literally replied saying, you know, like stop this, like yes it happened, but it wasn't my fault or some <laughs> shit. It's like oh hell no, like yeah, that's gonna work on the Eagles, girl. So not only did they have a three-way at school. Yes. No, no, it wasn't just... at school. That's the mm. weirder thing. Well, it's still weird, but it was just because it happened During when school, school was on. So they were truant. Like, they weren't I at see. school when they should have yeah. been. No, our, our school <laughs> was like that, dude. Like, you... get the pool ball? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Where did they get the pool ball? I, 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 I would, I have just, the I would imagine table. maybe they, yeah, maybe they were having sex on the pool table. Yeah. I don't know what, I don't know what compels someone to be like, hmm, pool pool? <laughs> <laughs> just like yeah, frantically yeah. looking around they their should, surroundings well, for while, something to put in there. While they're My suspended, instead, big of, <laughs> <laughs> instead of sending them like, uh, their homework home, they should send them one of those things where it's like, all right, the circle goes in the circle. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> The circle doesn't go in the triangle. It goes in the circle. <laughs> well, they're still forcing it in there anyway. Yeah. yeah. It was always like, if you do anything during school, it's like, would you get suspended for it? Like, <laughs> yeah, no. such a weird, yeah. weird yeah. punishment. That we, is even even just like outside strange. of school hours, it was, the, it was weird. Like, if you did something fucked up enough in town, like the school <laughs> would take action against you. And it's like, but I was like, I was at the mall on a Saturday. Like, yeah, what? if it yeah. happened at like three thirty after school was out, they're like, yeah, it's fine. It's like, yeah, no, yeah. as long as it, as long as it didn't happen during school. Can you imagine yeah. the funny things you do when you're in like panic like that? Because those guys yeah. definitely panicked like immediately. Like you think, and you you know when you panic, you do funny things. Like th- you think they put like a vacuum. Like up to her pussy uh, to like see if they can <laughs> try to suck, suck it out or something like that. Put a bunch of butter out. up there. Yeah, they, they, yeah, they, they like go like. Tiny plunger. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. I honestly well, feel like they would have just not because I think they were the type of guys to be you know sleeping with a new girl every week. I could uh, always see them yeah. being like, "Oh, yeah. what are we gonna do to this one? We've done it all already." <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, see, I'm the type My of guy where tour. when I when I inevitably put a pool ball in your pussy, I'll stick around and help you. Yeah, <laughs> you know, like, I was the kind of guy yeah. I am. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. Can you imagine? That's, if, but like, that's just me. Can you imagine if they tried to like fucking get it out by doing like the Super Mario Sunshine <laughs> Piranha Plant boss battle? Like she had a big ball and they ground pounded. <laughs> they ground pounded. I wonder if it's happened like Her belly button. I was saying kudos that like it would probably like dox where we went to school because it's so specific. But I swear <laughs> it's probably happened somewhere else, right? <laughs> I mean, you know. yeah. Did you guys have the rumor? Like I think it's I've heard it from multiple different schools, but it would be like a girl puts a test tube vagina test tube in her vagina during class and crossed her legs and it smashed. Did you ever have oh, that God. thing going oh, around? God. What? No. The fuck? No. So then, <laughs> oh. Okay, well, because that was a story that we had, but then I would I spoke to like friends from different places in the country and that all heard yeah. the same thing from what? their it was own a school. PS- yeah, it was a PSA. <laughs> Because New Zealand insane. just had a big thing with putting uh, test tubes in pussy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I thought it might have been one of those, things, that 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 yeah. one of those yeah. child childhood myths. Like um, you probably yeah. you probably heard the one one the one that everyone seems to know is the Marilyn Manson removing. Marilyn Manson room. was a big oh, one. Oh yeah, it is. to suck his own dick. Yeah. <laughs> They're, Somehow they're went around the whole world before the internet. Like everyone yeah. just knew it. <laughs> yeah. That was a big one. And the one that I think got around a lot of it as well was that there were kids supposedly like soaking uh, vodka 
like tampons and vodka and then putting that in their like vagina or ass. I did hear that, that Which that apparently one, yeah. never actually happened. I mean, maybe yeah. someone I don't think heard you, that. And could you even get drunk yeah. from that? I don't know no, the that, science. I think that actually, I think that actually does work. Okay. I think if it you does. do it in your ass. I don't know well, about we'll the vagina. Try it yeah, I don't know if it really works <laughs> no, in the vagina. No, not your vagina, but in your ass. Yeah, try it in your ass, it might work. Yeah. No, it does, yeah. You guys try it at home for us and let us know. Jackass has done that. That's right. They've literally done that. Wasn't there like sure. a wasn't there like a guy? And this might have been on a thousand ways to die. Where like a guy was like an alcoholic and he had like fucking liver failure or something, and so he like he started doing <laughs> fucking enemas, but like he would just get like a beer funnel and like stick it in his ass and pour like vodka in it, and then he died. <laughs> he, thought that that, he thought that it wouldn't go to his liver otherwise. <laughs> <All right. laughs> it was something like that, and he fucking died. This will go to my heart instead. It can handle <laughs> this it. will go right to my, my heart. Brain. Can handle it for this sure. Will go to my old pit hamster. He's still living <laughs> yeah. up there. Yeah, how desperate are you to get drunk? That like you don't even, you know you don't even get the enjoyment of the taste of alcohol. You just well like, kudos. No. There are people out there. I mean, if you look at these fucking weed contraptions that motherfuckers it. make. Like, oh, yeah. pe- people go th- go to pretty big lengths to uh, to get a head change, you know? That's true, yeah. <laughs> true. Yeah. I feel like if, if you're that deep in the sauce, yeah, sure, pour some fucking vodka in your ass. <laughs> Why not? Do you think if somebody had their fucking jaws, like, if they had their jaws wired shut, do you think they'd put a Delta 8 up their ass? Like Kanye? After <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say, a, that's, yeah. What, that's what inspired <laughs> through, the through the Wire, actually. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually talking about the sl- slipping it between the eyes, wires and his ass. <laughs> yeah, his ass was wide shut too. <laughs> his shit was coming out like fucking Play Doh. Yeah. It's yeah, just a little curly string. <laughs> a little five, ten different strings coming out because his ass was like a drain. Yeah. That's I'm a fun image. spaghetti. Yeah, that's real fun. Someone feel free to do a full parody rewrite of Through the Wire, but it's about putting uh, <laughs> yeah, the Delta eight gummies up in Kanye West's ass. <laughs> yeah. I can't think of any, like, big uh, scandals that happened at my school, though. <gasps> Just back to the your original question. Oh, sure. Uh, the most I can think of is, I think in middle school, one of the, the gym teachers that worked with the the ladies got fired for uh, uh yeah oh it's usually always you know, at least one some cl- yeah some classic shenanigans <laughs> some, classic. some classic male gym teacher shenanigans <laughs> yeah there was a there was a rumor that one of the other schools yeah. in my town um the principal cheated on his wife who was dying of cancer with the like media studies teacher Ooh. And then she died of cancer. Ooh, that's, <laughs> he's got our, cancer in his cock. He's just our principal sprint. got caught drunk driving twice. <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> like he got, a second cha- he got a second chance and he's like, yeah. He's like, yeah, I just love this shit though. I'm bad, I'll blow it again. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to do this We had shit. so much. Oh, and then the fucking math teacher I had was like this creepy ass dude. He'd look under the desks and be like, just checking for phones. But he was clearly oh, looking up the what girl's the skirts. Fuck? Oh, what the? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Jesus. It was really what weird. The like, yeah. There was. I, don't know. I think the <laughs> worst the scandal at my. <laughs> I think the worst scandal at my school. It was like, it wasn't even like that big of one. But these two kids were, or these three kids were playing 2K. 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 Like that. One of them. They bet like whoever loses, the other one gets to come on. <laughs> oh my god, you was. told me this story. Sounds, yeah. This is really straight. And, but knows obviously, I to come on you. But obviously, no, it could like, be really funny. Like, wouldn't it be just so funny if he fucking so came? so funny if I just fucking come. But and he just, one of the, the kids guy was not the very serious purpose. about it at all. <laughs> one of the kids was not serious about it at all, uh-huh. I guess. And then he lost. And then... <laughs> The guy who won and the other guy held him down for like 10 minutes while the other kid beat oh, up and oh, came Jesus. on his face like against his will. Big, big yeah, that's crazy. That's that's crazy. Crazy. Dark, assault. It was, <laughs> yeah, no, it was, it was like an assault. Yeah, that's it was like yeah. an instant thing. Like he loses, just comes on his face like a second later. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's well, that's the thing you think about it and be like, yeah. oh, it would suck to get cummed on. But then it's like, oh no, this, this dude has to beat off and like watch porn in front of yeah. me while they yeah, hold me down a- and push my face into his balls for like ten minutes. No, yeah, yeah the, the kid uh, who got nutted on switched schools, and the other ki- the other two kids were like immediately, they immediately became like, no, <laughs> they just the no, video? they just did it. They literally it just, just, spread, it just spread like wildfire. No, yeah, <laughs> someone told someone, and then it was off, and then the teachers heard about it and like contacted everyone's parents and shit, but. The one kid that got cummed on transferred, and then yeah, imagine hearing that about your son. Just, yeah, just so you know, the other two just became like immediate outcasts. Like they they ruined. Like no one ever wanted to be friends with them again. 
They were just oh. like complete. Uh, yeah, freaks. I mean, fair enough. Uh, you, no, you, don't, yeah. you don't. You don't. You don't really want to be boys with someone. There's a, like a non-zero chance he's gonna hold you down and come on. I'm you. pretty come sure they got you. the shit beat out of them too by like people who didn't even care about good. the kid who got cummed on. But it was I just mean, like yeah. you don't come just, on another as, man, as bro. Rules. Fucking. <laughs> That's gay you gotta, as shit. We're gonna beat you. Gotta yeah. respect that they. You gotta respect that they didn't film it though. That means they were in it for the love of the game. No, literally, you know, they, were, they were just down for the love game of the game. game. They were just down to clown. It was just boys' night. Just guys being dudes. Did I? I think I told someone else this story recently. Did I ever tell you guys about the red beanie club at my school? No. That was so like getting a, it on. wasn't like an alternative to a red armband, was it? It's not going uh, that way. Sim- similar, similar <laughs> vibes. Uh, uh, th- this was like all the all the like jocks at my school and like some other s- schools in in my uh, in my area. They uh-huh. had this thing with the red beanie. It was a, it was a, it also a fantastic mesh of uh, a technology and uh, I don't know. It was really bullying beanie technology. Was, but it was they had a Facebook group just to date it as well. Um, where this was in like year 11, uh, 12, 13, I think. So people were like 16, 17, 18. Uh-huh. And they, whoever, whichever guy hooked up with the ugliest girl that weekend that had to wear a red beanie to all social events until the oh next guy God. got the beanie, which is How did bad they rate enough. them? Did they do like a collective? I guess, yeah, was, I guess, like the, I guess the, fucking the, council, the council came uh, together to judge. Um, the but then Fortnite top- overrated kids, fucking yeah. <laughs> so aesthetic, right? Who has to wear the beanie? Yeah. So that that's pretty bad. But then what would happen is they would take a photo, like you know, a photo of the guy wearing the beanie in shame, and then they did a write up about the girl, like without uh, naming her, but like still okay. like My that's God. not true. That's actually that's kind of like how Facebook started. If you I mean, <laughs> kind of, like, yeah, honestly, yeah, just true. using Facebook for its uh, for its perceived purpose, but yeah. um. Mark Zuckerberg uh, is smiling upon the red beanie brigade. <laughs> he gives, or whatever he gives you a thumbs up about. in the DMs. <laughs> yeah, just yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Thanks for using it how I wanted it to be used, yeah. man. Yeah, it's like a it's picture like, of him smiling. It's like Elon for buying fucking things so you unban the Babylon bees. Like, don't worry, guys. You, you, you're allowed to stay on here. Yeah. <laughs> but um, I think God. what happened was one of the girls, like, I guess saw one of the posts and like knew it was about her because she was like, "Oh, I hooked up with that guy." Yeah, that they're weekend. just talking about her really meaty, smelly pussy. And she's like, "That's me." <laughs> like, hey, my pussy's no meaty one's got smelly. a pussy like that but me. I know it. <laughs> oh, I was busy that day. I couldn't shower. But anyway, I think yeah. I think she like went to her mum, and then the mum went to the schools, and then they they all got in a lot of trouble. <laughs> Oh, I'm sure. I thought you were and just that- going to say they all got an A. Yeah, they all got an A plus. Creative Good work. <laughs> so that was, that, was the sc- that was one of the scandals at my school. I feel um, like... Oh, yeah, go ahead. You got another one? Oh, that was, that was... I mean, the other one was after I left, the, one, the drama te- there was a new drama teacher there, and she, like, slept mm. with one of the, the students. Uh, <laughs> what does it uh, always happen? Was it, like, a legal sleeping together, or was it... Yeah, it was, it was an 18-year-old, but he was, he no, was still a student, was so there was still yeah, a power yeah. imbalance. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, so not super chill, but not illegal, I guess. But uh, yeah, she got very fired. Um, but they also they, they had Snapchats like, of like they said to each other. Oh, they you got showed leaked, me that. Yeah, oh, I've got yeah. them. <laughs> you have them. <laughs> yeah, it's it's like yeah, nothing. Like, it's not nudity or whatever, but it's them yeah. being like. There's one oh, of her she, being like, teacher. "Oh, I've got after hours access to the school if you want to go." Oh my! Oh, they God. did it in the school. I think or was that just the yeah. cat? Oh, yeah, that's, so that's fucking. <laughs> The 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 illegality of bad? it has to be. <laughs> she was not worth it. <laughs> okay. I won't say. I mean, kind of funny the, the, the guy gets to be like a legend, and then yeah, the teacher exactly. gets fired. It's kind of yeah. <laughs> the patriarchy wins again. God damn yeah. it! <laughs> That's what the Bobby movie was really about. Hey, guys, rule. Yeah, teachers, get- fucking kids, drool. Rule. <laughs> I remember uh, at, at my school, uh, since I went to fucking high school, like pretty, I mean, I went to 10 different high schools, just for the record. Was that because so. you were the guy who got cummed on? <laughs> yeah, that was me. I, was, <laughs> I, was, I couldn't mo- win 2K. I, mean, I, I don't know why I kept taking the bet. He just wasn't good at the game. I mean, so I went on my cum world tour. No, I, so the, the first high school I went to, it was because uh, I, growing up in California, pretty close to the Mexican Cowboy. border, right? And so... Fucking, there was a group of kids at my school who took a, like, small weekend trip to, like, across the border into TJ, and uh, they were found in a van that was, like, shot up. 
Dang. I think, what oh, the fuck? Jesus. Yeah, there was like five or six of them that were just like found dead in a van. Did they challenge them to play 2K? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and when they told them the stakes, they were, like, were pretty yeah, upset about it. that's the cartel version. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, if I win, I get to shoot you. In the face. <laughs> I don't like those odds, but I am good at 2K. <laughs> but I am kind of a ball. They don't even get anything for winning either. It's just <laughs> like <laughs> downside. Death? Yeah. Wait, because with the guy who got come, came on, there was no like. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah unless, you, unless you'd call, I guess, unless you'd call coming on your friend an upside. Well, the, yeah, <laughs> yeah. The, the other up, It was probably just oh, one of those right. things it was, where it's like. Yeah. yeah, it was like they said, oh, whoever wins gets to fucking come on. What if the winner actually gets to choose? They were, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> like, you come you on me. You can still come on me even though I won. <laughs> <laughs> That's a real friend. I Get do want to like win. <laughs> All right, I feel kind of bad. I'll just, I'll let you come on me. It's fine. Let's go ahead. <laughs> we can Take come as long as you want. Yeah. He's like, oh, thanks, man. You're the best. You're the best. Oh, fucking him up. beating his shmeat. That's the that's the, that's true, bros. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, yeah. Anyway, I like how all of us are like, oh, these guys like posted like were really like did creepy shit with girls or had their friend come on them. And Dovex is like, yeah, six guys got killed in a cartel shootout <laughs> in a van in six Mexico. Six big guys. And we, made, we made, and they're dead made in more a jokes van. about the dead people than the guy. This <laughs> <laughs> says a lot about society. Yeah. Interesting. I want to talk about a. a, a a tweet I saw, very representative of uh, society as a whole, as always. Go on. It was a tweet I saw that really pissed me off, <laughs> and I want to share it with ah. you guys now. Talking about Baldur's Gate, which is a game very dear to at least three of the boys' hearts. Uh, me, Bald James, guys and game. Andrew have been playing this. Uh, I think I've been playing this more than I've uh, worked uh, <laughs> in the last yeah, two weeks. Yeah, I have weeks. like 56 hours That's on it in the last every week ever of game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, if you've got, uh, theoretically, a, a, an excuse. Yeah. Um, do I? Gaming. You, 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 That's the gaming, only excuse. Gaming. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, gaming. <laughs> but, like, I think I've played maybe like 70 something hours. <laughs> it's fucking yeah. so. Amazing game. Amazing game. So, very, very, very amazing game. Anyway. But this fucking guy posted this thing saying, uh, with, with two images comparing the two, uh, these two things. He says, Degenerate game developers. As soon as you mentioned degenerate, uh, your opinions are validated. I don't care what you have to say. Um, but, degenerate <laughs> but game developers create. Create a porn simulator where you can be a genderqueer monstrosity with vitiligo vit, vit who fucks animals. Which is also like, why is vit, why do you have a problem with vitiligo out of <laughs> all like, as bad as fucking animals? <laughs> Isn't it yeah. just real life anyway? <laughs> yeah. 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 It's so funny. Like, <laughs> and you could be a bald guy. Yeah, the the woke uh, the woke <laughs> Vitaligo Gate character gone perspective, woke. like putting anything into a game that isn't just normal everything is like, oh, you're just pandering to the Vitaligo crowd. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of you want that, it you does want that seem to be money a bit. Like I I think I've only seen like one person with it in real life, but a lot yeah. of gaming people do actually just like that's like it, the only other option they have. It is, yeah. a, it is a weird. There is a weird amount of Vitaligo representation lately yeah. compared Bro. to like what it is in real life. But it's also like fuck more options. Who gives a shit? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It doesn't really I, matter. It's just you, odd. in Baldur's Gate, <laughs> yeah. you make like a companion, and like everyone makes it a, a hot girl because it's like, why would you not make a companion a hot girl? And yeah. uh, bro, I vitiligoed that bitch up, and it made her like twice as hot. So shout out. I Vitaligo did the same Lighters. thing. It looks <laughs> dope. People have been yeah. a hot shout out. Anyone, could you give her a cock as well? well? <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, you could. Yeah, you can. Certainly can. can. You, no, you, can't, you can't give your guardian a cock. Don't, uh, I tried. Wow. Um, but you, yourself, absolutely, you can do whatever you want. But yeah. so, uh, and then, so he said that you can make you can make this genderqueer monstrosity with a Lego who fucks animals. <laughs> then get upset when the majority of players create normal looking men who romance pretty elf lady. Um, oh. So the, the, what he's referring to here is there was a post which I, James had some interesting insight on as well, which I thought was extra funny. Uh, but here there was this post from when the game was in early access, where they but, talked but about. But this how guy framed it as it was just just for context. This guy framed it as if this post was from like five days ago when the game like launched. Mm. Yeah, so uh, like already he's misled lying. Misled everybody. Yeah. yeah, but it was it was just this post, this community post that like the the devs put out. Like it was definitely like a joke if anything well and james there's actually more to it than that but to me it reads like a joke where they're yeah. talking about like oh we took we, we used the like the data from people play testing and we we like averaged everyone's character together to like create the the most popular character i suppose like they took like yeah. you know the most it's common race male, the it? most yeah, common skin color, most common face 
Yeah, so it's just it's just a white guy with brown hair, you know. It literally looks like Tom Holland. And and the gag they were just saying is like, oh, we gave you guys like the ability to make fucking like demons and like have like crazy, you know, do all this crazy shit, and you you just yeah. made a generic character, which is like I feel like taking the piss. But well, James has uh, some more insight on it. Yeah, like the the post is like a little bit like tongue in cheek, but and like like if you read it like completely out of context, it'd be like, oh, are they really upset about this? But the the post was from like three years ago when the game was in alpha access and it was like an inside joke amongst the because this was among this us? was when it was like first flighting <laughs> <laughs> was, so like it was like an inside joke between the the like the flight testers and like the devs because what really the point of the post was like hey we're like bug testing the game and you all made the same character like we need to see if the fucking the yeah, tiefling's the tail tiles. like doesn't fucking like clip into the ground and shit. <laughs> So, yeah. But this guy played it as like th there's a gender the queer ego monstrosity pedophile like dev developer that's like wait you didn't want to be me you yeah. didn't want to be just a white guy <laughs> this guy's framing is like furious that like people are uh, not engaging yeah. with like those aspects of the game and then getting yeah. mad that everyone's romancing shadow heart like I did as I like, see, yeah, like a bitch she's a or bitch. something we won't get into the story aspects of it but look she's she's like a, a conventionally attractive like okay, you guys white just spoiled up white elf right chick. no we will not spoil board escape that's where i draw the line she's an attractive <laughs> elf lady so it's like well uh -huh. fucking obviously that's what a lot of people are gonna go for time me she's barely even conventionally attractive with her facial structure at 40 she'd be hideous so <laughs> <laughs> she hit the wall like, yeah shadow right heart true, more like shadow she hit the wall. She Elves usually gate. live for like a thousand years, right? It's like, yeah, they hit the wall at 400. Don't yeah. worry. <laughs> but you're just some human who lives to 80, so like you won't yeah. even get to see yeah. anywhere near that. Um, yeah. But like, it, to me, that engaging in media in that way is so, so lame uh, for a number of reasons, obviously. But like, it, it's as bad as those people who are like, um, how come the first female representation in Oppenheimer doesn't happen until 18 minutes in and it's for a sex scene? <laughs> It's like that, that is just as lame as as that. You know, you know why? Yeah. Because historically, women were underrepresented in sciences. So this is a historical movie. So they will also be underrepresented in sciences. It's yes. not because it's not because Christopher Nolan hates women and thinks they're stupid and have like dog brains. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's literally just because he's telling a did, historical story. It's, you it's idiot! Failed the Bish, Bishdel test, didn't it? Uh, did it? It failed the Bishdel test. Totally failed. <laughs> <laughs> there was no brunch anywhere. Yeah. But um, there were titties, so it makes up for it. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Imagine yeah, if that's like the auto pass, like the, the, the Bishamal test gets oh, yeah, titties. titties, they love it. <laughs> yeah. Automatic I just don't get like if if you're if if you can just make oh you know, whatever, a white guy that looks all normal and like chud. And it's like then you're still upset that other people can make shit that doesn't look like that. It's like, bro, you're the snowflake. Yeah, you can well, still like, be a chud, yeah. and they can be yeah. a vitiligo pedophile bear fucker or whatever. Like, <laughs> yeah, cool, bro. they just they just, just tick the box that says pedophile. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's one of the, it's one of the options during character creation. It, yeah. 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 Who are you attracted to? Yeah, but but like that, that's the funny thing, right? These these people who like get really mad at these like they're like, oh, they wanted us to make yeah these these hideous blue haired libs. Uh, who could fuck goats, <laughs> and then everyone chooses to make a white guy fucks a hot elf woman. It's like, it just, it's that fucking meme from Rick and Morty where it's just like, no, that was always allowed. Like, no, yeah. they programmed in the hot elf woman as well, you do realize. Like, they, they also gave you that option. If yeah. they really wanted to push an agenda like you say you are, they would, you would only be able to have gay sex in the game, um, and all the women would be, like, butch lesbians or something. So just, yeah, that is, just which dwarfs. is not the case. Yeah. There's, there's a full spectrum of every kind of character or whatever you're yeah. into yeah. i will say though i have accidentally fucked three of the male companions of the game like <laughs> fully not trying to like, so, i mean their dicks just keep falling in my mouth little... i don't know i keep, I, I keep <laughs> charging them to 2k and <laughs> bi <I was> gonna... <laughs> there's some bi confusion going on because i swear yeah. fucking i so, like legitimately i'm Bisexual just trying to talk to the, the the tree and i'm like I'm reading faster than <laughs> the they're saying it. So, so, you. <laughs> well, like, I'm trying to read through the cat, the dialogue tree, and I'm skipping branch. some stuff because they're talking too slow. And then it's just like <laughs> you, you go to the next line, and it's like, oh yeah, last night was wonderful, but we don't have to talk. And I was like, wait, what? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? Checks your asshole for a pool ball. 
Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah, in your exactly. inventory. It's you're like a dice. It's a D twenty in your <laughs> asshole. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what is it? Oh. Yeah. So anyway, that guy sucks. Uh, yeah. Fuck you if you if you engage in media in a very lame way. Yo, can I show you guys a video that I found specifically yes. for Dolan? This has four yeah. likes. Did you just get served this and fucking oh, yeah. recommended? <laughs> so, so yeah, James James then, yeah, then I watched it and I was like, oh, this is a Dolan Dark classic. He's gonna love this one. J James has the special talent where he finds these videos with like these shorts with like six <laughs> views that are just by like the most broken people and then he brings I them do, the I, I get like random shit in the recommend of like 300 views. Yeah. 10 years old. It's like someone's fucking final class project. I'm like, why is <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> Wonderful. I love that shit. All right, James, what's this? All right, uh, I don't. I mean, I you know, I don't want to spoil it. It's such a, it you know, it's such a masterpiece. So I'm just gonna yeah. let it speak for itself. I feel like I know what's coming. Oh yeah. There's surely got to be like a thug life or Chad me, right? <laughs> no, nope, that was like, that's, okay. That's what I was thinking. I was like, I was like, I must be missing massive context on like yeah. Indian YouTube or something, because like that's probably like a fucking like a chud edit, like a where it's sunglasses like, yeah. dropping down. Yeah, that like yeah. Hundi, Hundi is like the fucking <laughs> yeah, it's like the alpha music that you on TikTok. Music. Yeah, yeah. Uh, we, I we like the random what he's lightning saying. gif above it too. <laughs> yeah, I, don't, like, I don't understand why that's up there. <laughs> it's just fucking going. Look at the intro is just doing very it's like cool. The, it's probably great. It's like they have subway surface for us, but they just have access to lightning gifs. So that's what they <laughs> yeah, it's just really talk. cool lightning <laughs> loops. Yeah. Attention. I wonder what he's uh, saying. Play it again. Hey, dude, he's so angry. Yeah. Maybe someone, someone in the comments will know. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds so unepic as well. It goes all quiet. <laughs> it just no, yeah, goes like someone whispering Hundy Hundy. Uh, yeah. Uh, hundy Hundy. Cool, just say cool vid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cool vid, man. Cool vid. Hundy <laughs> <laughs> Hundy. Hundy Hundy. It, hundy. it is funny to think of like, how there must be all these different memes like that. And honestly, I wouldn't be surprised if there is like stuff like you said, like this is their yeah. version of. <laughs> You know, Chad, yeah. Chad Woj fucking based uh, sunglasses. Yeah. I wonder down. if, because we're still in like the early days, but you know how we were talking before, I think before recording, like living on, like your name lives on yeah. With, yeah, until yeah. the last person speaks to you. But like if YouTube's around 100 years, I just imagine one of our videos just coming up and someone's recommended like, like this fucking video. Yeah. Has. So it's just like, yeah. what the hell? <laughs> anyway, James, who's this, who's this beautiful bitch whose feeling is, feelings are hurt? Yeah, this is wonderful. <laughs> Yeah. So I uh, I got this as an ad on YouTube Shorts the other day, and oh. I I uh, you just watched Why is it, it but Apple Pay. <laughs> Wait, what you say? Is that an hundred? ad for Apple Pay or is okay? Just... Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, keep in mind that this is an Apple. This is an Apple ad. H Apple oh. tr first company to hit a trillion dollars, a trillion dollar company, a ten I figure company. AirPods. This is this is the ad they produced for YouTube Shorts. My feelings are hurt. My ex just told me I look 100. I'm 93, but I feel like 70. Can Apple Pay make me look 70 again? Let's find out. See you at the swan. I made it. I'm so excited. This is Katie. She just fucking dies halfway through the air. <laughs> like she's she's actually dead now. She's they're just doing a weekend at Bernie's on her. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you got Jeff Dunham fucking puppeting her from her asshole. <laughs> See, I can look oh, like fuck. 70 if I want to. I sure <laughs> am. Thanks, Apple Pay. Oh, what did it say? oh wow, I take it back. <laughs> How is that an ad for Apple? Yeah, what it, like, is I'm so confused it's by so, that. It's, so, it's just meant to be like a TikTok ad. It's uh, like, yeah, I think yeah, so, it's, yeah. It's like they're what? hoping people don't catch on it's an ad until they're like halfway through <laughs> yeah, and they yeah. want to see it like, through to the oh, end. Oh, what a cute old thing. lady. What, what like is an ad for the, cash? The actual advertisement <laughs> part of it, she literally just, she doesn't, th there's no product placement or anything. She just like holds her phone up to a thing and goes, ding, ding. <laughs> and then it hard cuts and it hangs for too long and hard cuts to a fucking <laughs> iMessage text chain. Yeah. And it's, I look 70. <laughs> My I, my ex told me I look a hundred. What the he fuck? He said my pussy smells. 
Bro, your ex, your ex has been dead for 40 years, bro. But like, <laughs> yeah, you, 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 gotta take, the you gotta re up on yeah. that medication, dude. You're hallucinating again. Your husband She's died in the herself. war. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's such a like. Can this I, $50 bill make me look it, 70 again? It is 10,000 <laughs> likes. Like, what the fuck kind of person likes an ad? Shot what is children. Like, what the fuck is wrong? Yeah. With you? Yeah. 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 It's yeah. such a belabored age. It's such a belabored bit too. And you can't like, see the dislikes yeah. either. Oh, of course. Yeah. Such yeah. a belabored yeah. bitch. Damn. Damn. Yeah. Bit and uh, bitch. Get her ass. No, nah, but it's. Got I don't know. It's so. Like, it's one of those gags you'd hear, like, okay, well, uh, here's the joke. There's a 70-year-old woman, she's acting like she's 18 and goes to this. It's like, okay, that already sucks, but go off, I guess. Yeah. And then they extrapolate. Like, that was such a long... If you're going to do that, at least make it, it like, so snappy. Long, yeah. Like, yeah. just be like, my ex says I look 100. I'm going to go to the salon. And then just cut. I'm at the salon. <laughs> Quick cut of montage of fucking makeup. Quick cut of her coffin. Yeah. <laughs> Fast forward. She's doing <laughs> fucking vine doom sound. Yeah. That'd be way more effective. <laughs> this is her burning alive. Quick cut. That would have been Can funny. Apple Pay make me look beautiful for my wake? <laughs> Can Apple oh. Pay pay for my cremation? Dude, that would have been funny if at the end, instead of texting, instead of texting her ex back, she's like at the cemetery and she's like, "Fuck you!" to like a, a grave. That would have been funny. That would I would have I would have taken that back. That would have been a good twist. That would have been funny. Yeah. Instead, it was at the. I, I think I mentioned this way back in like one of the first episodes where we talked about like our pet peeves. One of my biggest pet peeves in terms of like jokes or whatever is old person X like they're a young person because oh, all yeah. these. All these companies do it because I guess it's like a safe joke or whatever, but it's like they'll have like a granddad like skateboarding and like yeah. fucking t talking on TikTok and shit. And it's like, this sucks. How I mean, do there's, you do, fellow kids? There's the, one yeah. old lady. There's one old lady TikTok that's actually like really fucking funny. Oh. I think I've sent it to the chat before. It's like, uh, I, I think I have it saved on my phone. If I find it, I'll send it. But it's just like, she's like got like a smoker's cough. I don't know if you guys have ever seen it. <laughs> Like, I'll, yeah, I'll no, see yeah. if I can find it. I, I just <laughs> I'm, not saying old, I'm not saying old people can't be funny doing this shit. No, like, yeah. This is who they are. Fuck yeah. But like these ads that are specifically like the entire joke is just that they're an old person doing young people doing shit. Like if you yeah, just replaced, shit. if you took the same script and recast them as a young person, it would it would be nothing. There'd be no jokes. Yeah, <laughs> yeah and it's like it's the a, marketing lead that came up with this probably gets paid like $450,000 a year with oh, stock 100. options. And it's like, yeah. It's like, bro, what the fuck? <laughs> this is the what best the you fuck? can do. I got Apple, a great idea. Let us write your TikTok ads for you. We'll do a good yeah. job, I promise. Everybody yeah, will love yeah. it. Yeah. It'll be Apple uh, make everyone's phones blow up in their pockets and hurt their wiener and shit. Yeah, it'd be really fun. Send them the fucking Ow, my Arabic penis hurts code. because of my phone. <laughs> Can Apple Pay fix my penis? <laughs> okay, I'm at the penis Ding. reconstruction. I'm fucking. at the penis salon. <laughs> salon. She has like a, a botched fucking cock. It's like hanging on. It's a, it looks yeah, it's like a still fucking... a woman. <laughs> It's <laughs> getting a penis no, put it's, on. No, it's this old lady with her botch yeah, cock. Yeah, she's getting a yeah. penis it looks, put on. It looks like a fucking Rottweiler, like, attacked a pack of hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> it's all, like, open and gory and fucking filled with yeah. sinew. And she still does the same. Got a pool ball in it. <laughs> yeah. Spread out there, just a massive... And then... As it as it hangs on her for too long, you hear the pool ball fall and slap the cement floor. <laughs> <laughs> Roll away on the, the Can hardwood. Apple Pay get this pool ball out of my pussy? <laughs> <laughs> ding! I just ding. play here the ding sound as the pool ball hits the ground. Yeah. <laughs> hey, we got questions. Slippy Dongbag asks. Dolan, I've seen your name pop up in a few big uh, Twitter interactions. What were a couple of your favorites? I can't, I can't even <laughs> think of any off the top of my head. <laughs> what, the one I, only one I, I can remember Jeff. is like, is um, ratio and Keemstar before ratios were a thing. <laughs> yeah. Back in, okay. like, back in like 2016, he's yeah. tweeted, because I was beefing with him because it was funny, and he tweeted yeah. something like, <laughs> It is funny. My, my viewers care more about uh, PewDiePie stubbing his toe, then like Dolan Duck dying in a car crash, and oh. I just replied like, "If if I get more likes than your comment, will you report on it, or am I more important?" And then it did. <laughs> and I, I, I only remembered it because someone like DM'd me it last year and was like, yeah. "Did you invent the ratio?" <laughs> you invented the like, ratio. I was like, "Ooh." 
<laughs> True. <laughs> if you follow any big page on Twitter, you'll see they all just repost. The most yeah. common thing is they'll they'll see a tweet like getting some numbers. They'll click on it, see the top reply, and then they'll quote tweet with that reply as oh, if it's their own joke. Right. Oh, it's like a rare. If bruh. you if you if you follow a bunch like I do, you see them all just posting like the same sort of yeah same sort yeah, of joke yeah. you're like it's, they just totally just stole that from someone they all and retweet they, each yeah. other and shit yeah they do too they actually have a group chat where they all retweet their own <laughs> sponsors and stuff <laughs> yeah. so cool. i was Very i epic. was added to it so um, for, like, yes. for like a for like We've a, got a day man on the inside <laughs> i think yeah. i think just because like i was a big account even though i didn't right. fucking tweet and then they removed me but i saw them all like planning the retweets and the payments <laughs> oh, and shit. Yeah. So oh my god. god isn't there like uh isn't but, it like all the the really really big accounts on twitter like fucking kira and that uh, they're like the, those accounts you see literally they have everywhere. those are the ones with the group they they all do yeah, yeah. We, yeah. they've been around most of them have been around for ages and they did the thing called tweet decking which would, yeah. they would yep. like they'd make a new gimmick page that all retweet it and it would blow this page up Right. get hundreds of likes and then they would just sell the account but now oh. they can actually make fucking shitloads of money off it with Dude, monetization I'm, I'm, is I'm sam the like decides a... in those group chats <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. who was that oh, oh, sam the decides. Okay. Oh, you're that's, on the naughty list we'll have to have you back oh, on to a whole one. fucking I know hour long episode he's yeah. the one who's trying to, trying to become a fucking youtuber by reading his yeah. followers <laughs> names <laughs> yes <laughs> exactly you, yeah. you, you do know if, our boy he, you yeah. literally he decide sucks. if santa's put you on the list or not Dude, and, yeah and it's the he's most trying pain. to rebrand or something like no, is that what's well, happening he's 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 trying the to do jake sort of man he, yeah. he has well, like yeah, 20 so different deep twitter accounts but they all suck yeah. as well they're all stuff and they like, all have blue check marks so he's paying like a hundred dollars a month in fucking yeah. <laughs> yeah. So funny bro i'm like looking forward to bringing back peter decides this this fucking christmas season bro i've been Hell i've yeah. been yeah, yeah. Oh, peter yeah, decides decides page. yeah. yeah. Peter just one decides, night i was, peter one night I was high and i and i just i, I made this fucking family yeah, it's just, guy, right? It's Peter <laughs> decides Peter and it's Griffin. just it's just uh, this really grinds my gears or I don't even remember what the positive freaking, one is. It's, it's freaking it's, sweet. Yeah, it's, like, it's, it's freaking yeah. sweet. sweet. <laughs> yeah, I just post hey, like Lourish. hamburger. Oh my god, god it's freaking hamburger. sweet. Yeah, that <laughs> was I missed god. that. That was such a funny pair. It's almost it was, time yeah. to bring it back. Also, Tintin's yeah. funnier than, it, than Santa decides. Yeah. Does yeah. he still do the Santa stuff? He does. Yeah, well, he's been outside of Christmas. Yeah, he, he does it all doing year now. Yeah. Yeah. I just remember seeing him. He was like, "I really want my channel to blow up," and I go to it and I was like, reading, <laughs> reading the names of people who'd like to tweet. Dude, I was like, yeah. it is... "What is the fucking?" Well, I think, I think never... the theory is that it was to blow his watch time up so he could monetize. Yeah, oh, yeah. And he oh, makes okay. like a five-hour-long video, then only yeah. like so many people have to watch that. Well, it's, it's, have you seen his cool uh, wrestling uh, videos, <laughs> like yeah, where he dresses say, up and stuff? If you go to his TikTok, he has a character that he plays called Jake Man, Jake where he runs around. He runs Jake around like a Jake Man. And he's got like he's got like a <laughs> Oh, fucking... he's he's put himself in it before. Yeah. 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 Uh, he's got like a wrestling getup and he just runs around playing with his dogs while giving like Batman commentary. In slow and it's motion. like it's the, it's the weirdest fucking thing I've yeah, ever he's, seen. He's also just horribly unfunny. So he's like yeah. trying is he trying to copy the Bat Dad guy? Oh, Honestly, maybe. Probably, Actually, everything, yeah, maybe. Everything he does is is ripping off something else. Or like the other, yeah. thing, other thing yeah. on this TikTok as well is he's doing all this shit where he's like, like, oh, this would be a cool. I'm just gonna copy this trend or something where it was something something stupid shit where he's like, oh, drinking a beer every day until I, I don't know. It was some just really lame shit like that. Until my like, depression goes away. Or like yeah. trying to like engagement bait people, being like, tell like, what's a story you think of when you know just that kind of yeah. like lame. So many, yeah. so many questions on Twitter now since. The no, yeah, that, I, yeah, I was gonna say that yeah. since the monetization, all these accounts that used to like post pretty funny memes and stuff, it's now just, so annoying. And now just nothing it's but so like, annoying. what would you I'm do in this situation? Yeah, I yeah. made twelve dollars from Twitter, so <laughs> <laughs> yeah. so holy I shit! Did <laughs> I didn't even have to um because I I think. Because I got auto verified for being over a million followers, oh, but right. I think I also yeah. got. I still can't apply for the subscriptions. Not that anyone pays for that shit anyway. But yeah. Because you you need to have like tweeted in the last thirty days <laughs> and get like five million impressions like yeah. a month. And I don't tweet. My last tweet was the Keemstar copy pasta. Yeah. <laughs> Christmas last year, yeah. which is another banger. So it's like it, has that, that just that pasta. one tweet made me twelve dollars just tweeting Keemstar <laughs> so copy pasta. <laughs> Yeah, dude, that's it, passive income. You just you just hey, tweet out that twelve dollars while you sleep, baby. I'm, yeah, I was wondering if, it, if it's you get 12, twelve bucks. 
if it's twelve dollars since like the fucking beginning of the year, then it's awful. But if it's twelve dollars for like a week and I haven't tweeted, I'm just like, damn. That's a, that's <laughs> How much a lunch? people are actually <laughs> fucking tweet making? Yeah. yeah, I'm gonna make a bunch of them and see if anything pop off. Just yeah. to be, like, do it. Do it. Cares. Be the what? Be make the one. So, be the one video account that's not soulless. <laughs> yeah. yeah. The worst <laughs> part, I think I, I tweeted about it to someone too, but like. They're making money off Twitter now, and they will still sell their soul for like fifty dollars to promote like the dildos and the sex yeah. shop. Yeah. 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 It's like you can literally make money now without having to do that. Yeah, yeah. but they're like what? they're so hungry for a sink. Yeah, the money is thing I ever so put little. in my pussy, ladies. You will not lose this in your pussy. <laughs> the Suckatron Five Thousand. <laughs> I love how that was an actual one too. Just a fucking fucking yeah. machine, like a yeah. vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I had a pool ball yeah. getting stuck in your vagina. <laughs> And you know when they like go on dates I'm not gonna or go let to their go. fucking That's so funny. Yeah. <laughs> when they go on dates or they go to like their Christmas fucking like family reunion, they they never are like, yeah, I make money tweeting. It's like I'm a social media entrepreneur CEO, like Santa yeah. decides. <laughs> I mean, it's like personal I'm YouTube, personal guilty Twitter of page. That. Yeah. I, I'll say I'm a video. No, I'll say I'm a video video editor rather than a YouTuber. But that's oh, like you are. Yeah, yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you can't. No, these guys. I'm a these social guys, like, media guru. <laughs> no, but yeah, Santa, Santa decides hasn't fucking edited for a living and made three popular yeah. YouTube channels. Like he literally yeah. is just a twenty fucking Twitter page. He's, he's a guy yeah. who made a gimmick account that like attracts literal babies. Like the, yeah. you go into the comments and got it. an ego off it too. Right? Yeah. yeah. It's like yeah. His, it's his, his, his fan base and Dream's fan base are like if it was a Venn diagram they're There's just a cross the same. Like yeah. it's just a perfect circle because or, like, like a pool ball. What? what <laughs> yeah like a pool ball. <laughs> <laughs> but like if you were if you were gonna Let's say someone posted a tweet being like, oh, who who's up with notifications on right now? Or like notification squad, who who uh, wants to yeah. hang out? Lizard squad. What kind what kind of literal uh, Lizard squad? What kind of any person over 15 would actually be like, yeah, what I'm <laughs> I'm in the notification <laughs> squad. Me. 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 It's Nody literally tw- it's like babies. It's little yeah. little, little boobas. Yeah, someone out yeah. there probably thinks he's actually Santa or some shit. <laughs> <laughs> Have Xbox. Please, Holy Xbox. shit, mom! He read my name on his YouTube channel. I want to skip the toilet. Skip the toilet for Christmas. Santa can skip the toilet. Skip the toilet. Never Xbox, please. has a bigger audience or ego been placed upon a more undeserving individual. I, I don't <laughs> agreed. Think. Actually, I don't know, know how that gimmick blew up, and I don't know how he got an ego from it. But yeah, it's That's pretty. It's a lot pretty of impressive. Gimmick accounts. I don't yeah. know if you follow many, but. Anytime they start fucking tweeting about their social stuff, their personal yep. stuff, it's like, bro, yep, I follow you for funny yes. cat images. I yeah, do yeah. not care about what you had for breakfast. I did look it up. He has done a tweet about whether Skibbity Toilet is on the naughty or nice list. It's on the, na- <laughs> no it's on the naughty list. No fucking way. <laughs> Skibbity Toilet. He Skibbity Toilet nothing. is on the naughty list, unfortunately. I feel like you could follow up, through his boy. tweets as like a... Uh, a temperature check on like whatever's going on on the internet. Because just like yeah. if anything yeah. starts... Anything that has like more than like five thousand tweets in the last twenty four hours, he'll make a, a fucking naughty or nice tweet about. Yeah, um, yeah. You can really keep yourself in the loop. Yeah, it's it's honestly. Oh. Yeah, you could literally just like you could put his tweets next to like a Google search thing, like what <laughs> like was Google popular trends. on the internet. Yeah, yeah, Google Trends. It'll be the same fucking thing. <laughs> like th- this one's kind of funny. Luigi is on the nice list. <laughs> Luigi. Thank God. Thank God Thank Luigi, Luigi made Luigi nice. I'm so glad. Yeah, yeah. I was really I was really hanging on the edge of my seat about wondering whether or not Luigi made it to the nice list. <laughs> yeah, thank God. <laughs> oh, were there anyway. any um were there any other questions? Yes, yeah, so, oh, yeah, yeah. oh, yeah. Did you see my did you see I asked myself a question? I didn't realize oh, yeah, I was you gonna until say. right now. I was like, God damn. I was like, yo, the, <laughs> what if the guest looks in here? Our fucking audience are such assholes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, uh, Jay asked a question for Dolan. Fuck you. Uh, what, what's your response? <laughs> True. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Well, actually, here's a good one, considering we brought it up a few times already this this uh, episode. Uh, Ari, the, the, the confusion with Dolan, Planet Dolan, uh, Sogadiosta, so- Sogadiosta says, "Do you regret your channel name?" <laughs> no. <laughs> I, I like how they don't like impl- they don't like reference why I would regret it. There yeah. could be yeah. so many reasons. It could be yeah. like the bad. Badly Just a drawn Dolan statement. Because yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess technically the Dolan comic is like 
a racist Donald Duck that kills his nephews. <laughs> 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 yeah. Nah, the, I, honestly, the best thing is because I started as a Facebook page and it was like dark humor. Mm. Yeah. The name, because it was like Dole and Duck, Dole and Dark. My right. original image was like Dole and Dark, but he was like brown. Black. Oh, that's right. <laughs> so like at some point when I transferred Black to YouTube, face. Yeah, literally. <laughs> or not like not actually blackface. Yeah. Imagine that. Yeah. Just a fucking, uh, yeah, yeah. But like at some point when I transferred to YouTube, I was like, do I stick with this or do I go with this random goose image I found? Like I'm yeah. just so I'm just so fucking glad I went with the goose. Yeah. Because at some yeah. point I would have had to rebrand anyway. Yeah. Like, exactly. It's mm-hmm. like, yeah, a white dude can't really just be a black <laughs> be a <laughs> brown dog. You blackface the dog from Disney? Yeah. What do you always say? No, I I'm I'm a mallard. I'm not a blackface duck. <laughs> yeah, what, what are the rules of that amongst furries? Like, if you're a furry who wants to be like a duck, can you be like a brown duck if you're a white guy? Or is, <laughs> sorry, not if you're I mean, a yeah, white I guy. If you're a furry, no, you no. are a white guy. I don't think that needs yeah. to. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> But can, I guess the fur, it's the fur as long as it's the person underneath <laughs> who fucking knows. Yeah. <laughs> He's doing what black fur. Black fur. <laughs> black face black fur I like that well we actually answered a whole bunch of questions there Claire asked why duck I think that kind of explains it yeah, um, yeah. and yeah, Arcadium, Arcadium asked how was the transition from Facebook meme posting to posting on YouTube which you kind of already answered I was um, gonna say that <laughs> that was like I made I, that's right I posted a montage parody I didn't make on Facebook and it blew up yeah and I was like Wait, these do well and they seem easy to make. And then that's like <laughs> Mondo's parents are literally I was like, I'm I literally like spent three hours learning basic video editing, posted a video to Reddit, and it like blew up on the montage parody subreddit. Yeah. And that was that was like legit the first like i was like oh shit views that <laughs> that's <money>. crazy <laughs> Yo. I, always remember, I always remember yours being like one of the like the better edited ones the oh idea. no yeah there yeah. was like there were a couple others that were um like really well produced and i was always like these are so easy to make i'll make one that's not complete dog shit <laughs> yeah <laughs> so unfortunately you, you- the best editor was outed as a also <laughs> his name was dolan dark uh, but yeah won't name that guy <laughs> wait so so you have a podcast with with pyro pyro notoriously started years ago on uh on like mlg montage like meme edits did you guys like link through that or is that, that just is, like a shared that's history we, that's how we met yeah oh, oh, that's, that's, okay that's oh. cool yeah i didn't know that a lot of the um people i'm not not that i'm in contact with that many now but Right. Like uh no fuckers from back then. Yeah, um, yeah. Colossus Wasn't Memulus oh, yeah. doing that shit too? Yeah. yeah. Meme as like either people like became commentary channels or they like fell off the fucking face of the earth. Yeah. Yeah. Most yeah. of the time. <laughs> That's the fork um, in the road. But a lot of the people that kept grinding and changed their content survived. It was just the ones that tried like commentary, like yeah. you know, didn't get the views they wanted and stopped. But it was yeah. like yeah. Anyone that kept doing it is still around, from what I've noticed. Yeah. Or the people desperately trying to still make montage parodies a thing. Oh, God, there was one guy who, like, <laughs> he had, like, one video pop off, and then he made, like, 20 sequels to it. <laughs> it. It was just something shit like MLG Lazy Town, and he was like, yeah, I'm going to make... This is one of my life now. Oh, I remember like, MLG four, Lazy Town. Four years, it probably wasn't that exact, but it was like four oh, years okay. after the trend had died. He's still yeah. making them. It's like, <laughs> let it die, man. Let that that trend did such a, it was such a flash in the pan. I feel like it was like yeah. the funniest thing I've ever seen. It was I about watched. a. Dude, that yeah, yeah awesome. it was like a good a good year they lasted. They wouldn't last a week these days. Yeah, well, that's the thing. Yeah, it was like yeah. it was everywhere I saw it all the time. I thought it was so funny. And then just one day I felt like I was like, oh, I haven't thought about these in a while. And you go on the subreddit yeah. and it's like dead. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. what's fu- what's one funny you asked about Pyre actually is I actually used to dislike him. Oh. Because um <laughs> Because like, because <laughs> the community was like so tight knit, right? And then right. it was me and a few others making these kind of like it's funny because it's still fucking montage parodies, but ones that were like breaking the mold, you know, the ones that were yeah. just, the joke yeah. wasn't just Dorito Mountain Juice spinning. And then Pyro <laughs> like was doing the, all the cliches and getting lots of views off it. And I was like, yeah. you know, you get, when you're a small account, you yeah, get jealous Yeah, of course, of it. you can't help yeah. it. But it was like, this guy shows up and he's like, yeah, I'm going to do all the cliches and get views and we're just like god damn fuck yeah, that guy, fuck guy yeah. <laughs> but then you realize, you realize like there's no fucking point being salty and comparing um, yeah 
But it's just funny that I like we started off not I started off not liking him. <laughs> and now you have a podcast with maybe, him. Maybe maybe one day Internet Asia will no, do still hate, podcast. Still thing. hate his guts. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, you're just forced no. to interact. Yeah. I think you I, should I, do I, a honestly, segment on your like podcast he, where you, you where you like compete to do MLG montages. Yeah. <laughs> speed runs. I did actually a year or so back, I did actually want to um do like a MLG comeback, just like a one-off video, and get like all the all the guys from back then to like edit a little part of it. But That'd obviously, cool. yeah, oh, obviously, one, cool. of, one yeah. of the biggest names is yeah, um, peanut boy <laughs> being nah, soiled. No, no, nah, nah, do a do a like a Roman Polanski where like all the big directors come out and like bet for him. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah. Sign God. a petition, like he's a good guy. I promise. <laughs> Separate the art from the artist. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah. it's a fucking Mountain Dew Dorito Mountain Dew. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just like the stupidest fucking thing. The fucking Tarantino of Montage Parodies comes out and defends him on national yeah. television. Yeah. <laughs> but even if you did, like, that's a really cool idea, Sans that guy, obviously. But even if you just did one, just. Sans? Undertale! <laughs> You're the real rage racer.